welcome. Welcome to snowshoeing and a boil up in northern Canada. Now that's pretty vague. Northern Canada, yeah, I'm here in northwest area of Ontario. Place called Pickle Lake. Absolutely beautiful. Presently going through some burnt forests. Yeah, they have lots of forest fires in northern Canada. In fact, I work with a forest firefighter. Anyway, uh, here we are. I hope you enjoy it. I'll be doing a review at the end on a grill that I purchased through Amazon. Less than $10 Canadian. I hope you enjoy that. And of course you'll have an opportunity to see one of my bloopers. Anyway, stay tuned for that. So this is Graveyard Lake. If you followed the other video, you know I spent a night here and thoroughly enjoyed it. And thank you for those that watched it. So without further ado, we'll get to find a place to have a boil up and start the video. Enjoy. Thank you. Bye. A bunny rabbit. No birch trees. That's a shame. So yeah, the uh, I should have known the difference. Um, old man's beard and spark. Yeah, I'm not gonna get the fire going. Not gonna happen. So back to the uh, to the lighter. Back up. I couldn't find any birch birch bark. I certainly could have taken the stick and shaved and got some good fine powder. Probably would have got the spark going, no problem. But anyway, I got a little lazy.
the flint. Ooh, as good as the uh, old man's beard is, it doesn't take well to spark. So, I had to use a lighter. And that lighter wasn't in good shape. Which is why you always bring matches. Three, two, one, blast off. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I just did that. Anyway, let's start this all over again. Arr. Beep, beep, beep. So I will do a, a review on the Coglin's uh, folding pack grill. Now in the second, uh, I do apologize for the stain on the pants. It is the tree. Please believe me, it is the tree. So anyway, it's the Coglin 8770 folding pack grill. There she is. And it's, uh, what is it? It's 12 and a half inches, I believe, by six and a half inches, which is 30, 30, 32 centimeters by 17. And it's quite light. It is seven, what is it? 35 kilograms. And it packs up nicely. So is it any any good? Well, I'll let you know now in a second. Even though I just had a blooper, that was not the pack grill's fault. Frighten the crap out of me. I've got turtles and s'mores, and I always go with turtles first. I got some chicken soup here, a real rough one. Huh? Campbell's chicken soup, but I think I'm just gonna have a hot chocolate. I got homemade spaghetti home, so I think I'll just wait for that. I think I'll just wait for that. goes our turtle thank you Nestle I don't know if these things will burn there seems to be a foil in there so I think what I'll do I'll pack that out and not burn it don't want to leave anything behind Okay, she's rocking and rolling there now. I better get my glove, spoon. How hot is this going to be? Very hot. No flavor. So we're in a place called Pickle Lake, Pickle Lake, Ontario, and so uh, we're as far north as you can go on road. Beyond here, you have to fly. So this is northern Ontario, northwest area, Pickle Lake. 
So if you want to do some serious fishing or hunting, come to Pickle Lake. Uh, there's some float planes that'll bring you in the back country. And uh, by the way, the ice road truckers come up through here when the uh, ponds and lakes freeze over. Some of the northern First Nation communities, they get uh, resupplied over the winter by these truck ice road truckers. And this is where they come through. So I'm gonna enjoy my hot chocolate, this fire, and then walk back home. So the question is then, will the Coglin Pack Grill get the thumbs up or not? Give me about 30 seconds, I'll let you know. It'll cool down a bit. Like that, nothing to it. I just slide it in the inside bladder, water bladder. There it is. No real estate. Thumbs up. Best eight or nine dollars I spent. I said seven, didn't I? But less than ten. Anyway, there it is. I'm gonna get ready to go. Make sure, check everything, that I have everything. Check three times. I gotta doubt the fire even though it's on ice. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'm gonna walk home and warm up some of that homemade spaghetti.